To inspect and replace the rail slides on your 650 or 850 Pro RMK Matrix or Matrix Slash, follow these steps. Ensure the snowmobile is on a flat level surface. Next, safely elevate the rear of the snowmobile. Refer to your owner's manual for proper lifting techniques. Then, inspect the thickness of the rail sliders at several points along the rail. If the slide is worn to the top of the wear limit indicator groove, the rail slides need to be replaced. Next, loosen the rear idler shaft bolt, but do not remove. Then, loosen the adjuster lock nuts on both sides to loosen the track. Next, rotate the track as needed to access the fastener securing the slider to the front of the rail. And remove the fastener. Then, rotate the track until the track window lines up with the rail slider. The slide will be removed through this window. Continue by using a pry bar and hammer to drive the slider back off the snowmobile through the track window. Applying a lubricant to the slide may aid in the removal process. Use care not to damage the rail when driving the slide back. Once removed, apply a lubricant to the new slide to aid in the installation process. Also, lubricate the rail to further aid in the installation process. Before installing, ensure the mounting hole on the slide is pointed towards the front of the sled. Then, begin working the rail slide forward until it has reached the end of the rail. Then, align the mounting hole and reinstall the previously removed fastener until fully seated. Once finished, repeat this process for the other rail slide. Once the slides have been replaced, reset the track tension by following the process listed in your owner's manual. Finally, ensure all fasteners are tight and safely lower the sled to the ground. For more information, see your authorized Polaris dealer or visit Polaris.com.